So yeah, I was doing that or whatever. And then I was just decreeing in the clearing over um, November and December, right? And I was saying um, that November and December will be uh, months of miracles, right? Months of miracles, months of uh, breakthrough and all this other stuff, right? Guys, you know how you, you, the Lord will lead you in prayer. He definitely had me praying that because he wanted me to pray that because I went to sleep and I had dreams. I went to sleep and I had dreams. So I'm going to share those dreams with you. I had a dream that evil people who were the elite created a man-made flood, right? Created a man-made flood slash tsunami, right? I think it was like the feeling in this dream was it was Florida, right? But it could have been New York. But the feeling in the dream was that it was Florida. Could have been New York. It could be both. So then it was a tsunami too. So then I was with my son, right? And I was holding my son, like looking at what was going on. And someone else was with me i don't know who was with me i didn't i don't remember the person or see see the person right um so then i went to the highest point that i could get so that we wouldn't get taken away by the water which that is is symbolic in itself right going to a higher place spiritually too right so as i'm going to this higher place I see dead bodies and I see dead bodies, people who drowned in, in the water, like the, like the flood came, the tsunami came, and now you see the, the dead bodies rolling by in the water. And it was a lot of people. And then I said in the dream, you know what, like, what am I doing? I'm going to be scared. And this is what I did in the dream. I commanded this wave to stop, this tsunami to stop, right? And then I, I said it once, and then I said it again. I said, in the name of Jesus, I command this wave to stop. And when I said it the second time, there were other people saying it with me. And then all of a sudden, the tsunami was coming in like this, right? It was like this, how a tsunami goes, and it just stopped midair. It just completely froze in the air. It stopped the tsunami, the wave. Um, and I knew, I knew like a, a lot of people died in the dream. I knew a lot of people died. And it felt like the people who were there, like, whether it was New York or it was Florida, but it felt like the people who were there, they felt like this was um, the end of the world, right? Because it's all about perspective, right? Like if something like that happens where you live, you're gonna feel like this is the end of the world because that's what you're seeing, right? But when, in the dream, I knew it felt like they felt like this was it. This was like the end of the world. Um, but to like the people, right? The evil people, the elitists, I saw them on TV. And the people who created this tsunami wave and this flood, they didn't care. They didn't care. And they went on TV and I'm not sure what they, I don't remember what they were saying on TV, if they were being exposed. I don't know, but I knew that they didn't, they did not care about anybody's life. They didn't care at all. So again, I had this dream um, after I went to sleep, after I was decreeing and declaring there will be miracles, signs, and wonders for the month of November and December. Today, I want to share a dream that I had um, on October 2nd. Um, in this dream, I was in New York. Okay, I was in the Bronx. And 
there is a flood. Everything was flooded. It was about 10 feet of water. And um, I was in the house and I couldn't leave because everything was just completely flooded. The streets were were like you couldn't you couldn't travel although i did see like one or two cars being able to uh suvs being able to drive through the water which really looked impossible but that's symbolic <clears throat> so then um I, i'm on the phone with someone and they tell me <clears throat> you better you better go through the back way through the woods to see if you can get out, <clears throat> you know, from the flood because everything was really being flooded. Um, then the scene changes and I'm in the street <clears throat> and people were outside and there were fireworks being lit up um, from the ground and just exploding in the air. And then there were cars and the cars were doing tricks. The cars were in the air, flipping around high in the air and people were marching. <clears throat> there was one set of people who had Christmas decorations and they were saying, this is like when Jesus will come, like Christmas. And I was saying to someone, um, and I was saying in the dream to someone, you see, this is God's word coming to pass, the flood. Okay, so, and then the scene changes and I was explaining to someone on the phone how the flood came, how it was flooded. And then the scene changes to say, oh, how, how did it flood? It looks like this. And then I get a vision, a still picture of like a typhoon wave in the air or a tsunami wave. And I was like, yeah, like that. And this dream took place um, when I was seeing the people marching in the street and the floods in the street and the Christmas decorations. I was like, I was like, Christmas? It's not Christmas time yet. Why is there Christmas? Why is there Christmas decorations? Why are they celebrating Christmas? It's not Christmas. And then I knew in the dream, I was like, well, hmm, I guess so. It's like almost near Christmas, I guess. So that tells me like it was around november that this was going on and it was a celebration in the street and i they said it was like when jesus came like on christmas you know like his birthday how he's gonna come again not in the way of the rapture but in the way of his glory and justice being served 